Rock Rochelle neighbors say that people are squatting in vacant homes in this neighborhood, and the main problem they have is that the homeowners aren't helping. When next door to me's lived here longer than me, neighbors right here have lived here longer than me, the neighbor yeah. in the yellow house has lived here. This neighborhood is an established neighborhood. The peace and quiet is why Gina Williams has loved her neighborhood since 2003. Never had any problems, no issues. But a couple of newly renovated homes changed her perspective. If you're not going to take care of it, burn it down. From the outside, this home on East 78th Street looks brand new, but on the inside, graffiti, leftover food, and even more trash. I was shocked. How could people live there like that? William says squatters have been living in the home since May. She says they were evicted not too long ago, but every now and then someone tries to get back in the house. My question is, what can we do to stop this? And she's not the only one. Fox 4 heard from several people in the neighborhood that fear this will continue to happen until the home is secured by its owner. It's hurtful, it's disgusting, but you know, people are always going to try to push the limit. Working for you, we found prominent rental listings online that say the home is managed by Main Street Renewal. We asked Main Street Renewal if they owned or managed the home and in response the company said in part quote, if we discover that an individual has unlawfully accessed one of our homes, we have a protocol in place where we make multiple attempts to work together to find a solution, including potentially offering the opportunity to apply for a lease to one of our homes. None of us want to go through that again. People couldn't sleep. We knew that the uh, illegal activity could spread to oh. other things in our neighborhood. And William says that there was another home in this neighborhood that people were squatting in. Rental listings also say that that home is managed by Main Street Renewal. John Christel.